Hi you guys, it's me Elena. So I just went ahead and did a video. Um, so I'm doing another one right now and this is a, a small Dollar Tree haul. And um, well I had bought some other stuff but I already have that stuff put away. And so I'm just going to share a couple things that I have right here. So the first thing that um, I'm going to share is, <clears throat> sorry guys, I found these boxes at Dollar Tree. And uh, my Dollar Tree does, they're like late to the party because there's boxes there that they haven't even unboxed yet. So I went to this other Dollar Tree that I told you guys that I found a while back. And they have a lot of stuff. So I picked up this one. Very nice box. The only thing I don't like that this label doesn't come off. It's like in the box. So I'm just going to have to see if I can just cover that or something. I don't know. I'll just leave it like that, I guess. So um, anyways, I love this box. So I picked up that one. And then I picked up this bigger one. As you can tell, the size in them. This one's smaller and this one's bigger. And it says, to Santa, let it snow. And then, look at the back. So I have some things in it. I'm going to go ahead and share that with you guys. So I bought these cards. They're Go Fish cards. And... I thought um, I can add them in my pocket letters and happy mail, uh, especially for the month of December. And um, I thought it was really cute. Just has a variety of different things. Um, they're also great for December dailies to add. Um, look at that. A lot of cute. Um, <clears throat> sorry, guys, my throat really cute so I got these I thought not bad for a dollar so um, I picked those up and then um, I picked up these napkins they have like different ones but <clears throat> sorry guys um, these were the only ones that I liked that caught my eye um, they had other ones, but I really wasn't feeling them. So I thought these were cute and I'm also going to Mod Podge them. So onto a project. And, um, so I got that, just put that there. And then, um, I picked up two of these, but of course I already uh, put the other one up already. And, um, yeah, I picked up two. I got this one. And the snowman. And these are really adorable for a dollar. So I picked up that one. And then um, I went ahead. Of course, I opened this one already. And this one is the refrigerator magnet. They had a bunch of these, like different ones. I was so surprised, you know. But you know what? That Dollar Tree is, they like have it stocked up and look at how cute that is so look at the squirrel winter wishes and look at the reindeer and you just you know pretty much add it you know and i can't wait to add this on my refrigerator uh i think i'm gonna put this i don't know yet so uh, i might do that and i thought these were so cute and um so this is the one i picked up and I might go back during uh, next week or something. So I picked up these window clings, which I thought was adorable. So they had a lot of variety of these, like different ones. And I only picked up a couple of these. Um, I'm definitely going back to pick up some other ones. And these are so awesome. I want to get a couple for my mom. I think she would love to put these up in the house. And um, these are so cute. Look at that. I might put this one in the kitchen though. Look at how adorable that is. 
really cute. So I got that one. So let me show you the next one. The next one is this one. Look at the gingerbread. Oh my God, the candy canes. I mean, it's just so adorbs. Oh my God, I love this. Under a buck. You know, Dollar Tree has really stepped up their game. I mean, really, on their products, their merchandise. I mean, you look at their craft section, and you would think some of like the stickers, the embellishments, like something you would get at Joann's or Michael's or even Hobby Lobby. So this is really adorable. So I picked up that one. So the next thing I picked up are the stickers. So let's go over the stickers here. Now these right here are tags. And what caught my eye was their self-adhesive gift tags. And you get a hundred of them. Look at that. So I already opened the package and you get a hundred of them. And they're also good for letters, uh, anything really. And I think you could never have enough tags. Now the only thing is I thought they were like different ones, but I guess they're all the same. But for a dollar, you can't beat that. Look at that. The gingerbread, the snowman, I mean so adorable look it can never have enough tags so I picked up that and the next thing is I picked up these and my Dollar Tree didn't have this not even the stickers I walk into this Dollar Tree that I went and they have a whole aisle of stickers I'm like jeez so yeah, look at how cool these are. Oh my God. I was like, I'm not getting no more stickers, but I need to get some for swaps and stuff like that. Plus I have other stuff that I've been collecting that um, those are gonna be separate for different things. Look at that, so cute. So I got one of those, I got one of these. Look at the penguins. Isn't that cute? I've seen them in the halls, but they look so much better in person. So that one. I got another one of those, too. So I got two of those. Oh, and I got another one of the snowman. Oh, my God. Let me open these because I want to see, like... You know, they're in package, so you can't really see the detail of them. Oh, wow, you guys. These are so, um, so worth getting these for under a dollar. I mean, that's really good. So let me show you what they look like. Look at that. Sorry, very close, but I wanted to show you guys the details. Look at that. Very nice. So, um, got that one. And then this one is the gingerbread. Oh, look at that collection. You get 28. Oh, my gosh. I got to um, open this one since we have the time. Let's see. And you know what? Just an idea. Okay, look at these ones. Look at how cool these are. They're so much better in person. Oh, my God. All the detail. They're very thin. They're not too thick. Oh, they're great for envelopes, Christmas cards, tags. You got it. And then, it, you know, it's funny because it has this whole... Um, how you call it, the chipboard that comes with it or the paper. And these right here, just an idea, because um, some, you know, you're a crafter, some are just beginning. And this is a good idea. You can cut these, cut them across, make little tags like that. And then you can add a sticker on there. Add a sticker and it's just a real cute 
tag, you know, and then you can cover that up. So, you know what? I never throw these away. When I get them in stickers, um, even some like this, if they're really good and shiny, I'll keep them. So when I do my glittery, um, like shaker cards or whatever, and these that I get in stickers, I keep them. Like even this one, I keep them and I reuse them. So you can reuse them. I mean, don't throw them away. They're very used for different things. And like this one, it's very good. Like that one, it has a hole, so I'm going to throw that out. And this one, well, I'm going to throw that out too. But I have some other ones. And they are very good. Like these, you can cut these up. Cut them up and reuse them. And then uh, cover the back with some scrap paper that you have Christmas paper or let's say if you don't have Christmas paper use blue paper or white cardstock and cover it and then cut it up and make your own recycled tags so I'll be I'm going to be recycling these and using them so you know just a tip you know out there so you know and these stickers are so awesome I love these stickers I'm so glad that I was able to find them and um, yeah so I wanted to grab more than just one because if you think look at all these and then this comes on the um, thing so of course I'm not going to reuse this but the stickers are really thin yeah I love it I really love these tags and I'm glad I got them really great great buy so anyways that is my dollar tree haul i hope you love the haul as much as i love doing them for you guys um so thank you thank you so much for my new subbies and for subscribing to my channel and i appreciate your love for um watching and commenting and you guys are so awesome yeah awesome so thank you thank you thank you now just a reminder if you've been watching the whole video through um i didn't mention in the beginning of my videos like the month of um how you say it the month of october when i first started my um giveaway challenge Please, if you still want to participate in my giveaway challenge, please do so. And um, go check out my challenge giveaway video for all the details. It's very easy. You just get a pocket letter, fill it up with some embellishments. It doesn't have to be Christmas. It could be anything that you want to share with me, which I should have did that in the beginning, but I didn't. So, uh, but yeah, I mean, if you want to send me um, Christmas embellishment that I can use in my December daily, that would also be great. Um, I'm working on other Christmas stuff. So the embellishments that I get is going to be toward my December daily and things that I'm working on. So if you want to do that, or if you have other embellishments that are not Christmas, even Valentine's Day because February is my big month of Valentine's. I love doing different projects and stuff like that. So um, anyway, so please do join and um, just email me for my address if you want to send it to me for an extra entry and um, do a video response for an additional entry. So um, it would be awesome. And um don't forget, I will be doing a video of some things that I pick up at Daiso. And if you don't know what Daiso is, it's a Japan store that they have here in California and other places. They are expanding and their store is like $1.50 and up. So um, I'll be back, you guys. Okay, you guys. <laughs> anyway, I had got a phone call and I was like, OMG. <laughs> Okay, so, um, yeah, so anyways, um, I forgot what I was saying because the phone rang. It's been ringing like five times and I already have a headache from it. 
So, um, but I wanted to come on here to do the video. So yeah, um, make sure you contact me um, for the um, giveaway challenge. And I always repeat um, about the pocket letter because um, right now time is so precious right now because time is going quick. We got to catch up on projects. We got to finish our Christmas, um, you know, buying all that. And it's going to be Thanksgiving this week. It's just uh, a day away and, um, and everything. So a pocket letter, all you have to do is fill it up and send it to me. That's it. And just message me so you're, you know, oh yeah. So what I was saying is that I have a Daiso haul which I'm going to share some things with you that I picked up and those items will be going into the giveaway. So in case if you don't have a Daiso and you've been wanting things from Daiso, this is a great opportunity to do the challenge and you can get some things that are very hard to find if you don't have a Daiso. Yes, a Japan store, $1.50 and up. They have stationery. They have all kinds of stuff. But anyways, enough rambling of me. So don't forget to comment. I will talk to you soon. I also, just to let you know, in one of my videos, if you've been watching, there is a hidden giveaway. So anyways, that's what you get for commenting, which I'm not going to say which video it is because I'm going to end it. But anyways, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching the whole video and um, watching everything that I've been sharing. So, okay. Thank you, you guys. Bye.